The SHARE lab is the sexual health and relationship lab. We're mainly trying to understand the factors that are associated with couples being able to maintain happier relationships over time. One of the things that we're working on right now is we're trying to understand how couples are coping during the COVID-19 pandemic. 54% actually felt more satisfied in their relationship. People might be stuck at home more than they typically are, so they might be finding new ways to connect with their partner. Couples also might be fighting more. About 29% of our couples said that they were fighting more than they had uh, pre-pandemic. For people dating, it's changing how we're able to meet and interact with people. People might do more FaceTime or Zoom meetings before they decide to meet up in person. We've done a little bit of work on social media and relationship satisfaction. So I think in reference to Valentine's Day, you might see more people sharing things about their relationship on Facebook. And generally this is sort of linked to more satisfaction, but oversharing can kind of backfire a little bit, at least in terms of how other people might perceive you. We've done a little bit of research on Tinder. So we found that people who use Tinder for more approach reasons, so looking to make an intimate connection, looking to have some fun, versus people who use it for more avoidance motives. So they're trying to avoid rejection or disappointment. It's the people who are more approach motivated that seem to have better dating outcomes. They perceive more success on Tinder. They're making stronger connections. Some of the ways that we've sort of learned to connect with others during the pandemic might remain and we might sort of keep those up.